Hi, my name is Henry and... My name is Justin. And we're doing Learn Power. Um, it's a project that shows we can use uh, green energy. And um, our hypothesis is that lemons can create power. And there are some materials you may need. Uh, two lemons, uh, some tape, a battery powered calculator, two steel galvanized screws or steel wire, two pennies or copper wire, a steel wire or alligator clips, and if you're using steel wire, then you'll need some pliers. Uh, you'll also need a blade or a pair of scissors, a wire stripper, and a screwdriver. And uh, the purpose of this project is to show that lemons can create power. Also to show that you don't really need other resources such as oil and coal to make power. Okay, you can stop it. The procedure we followed was first we rolled both the lemons on a flat surface. Then um, we cut a slit in each of the lemons and we had to make sure that the slit is smaller than the diameter of a penny. Then we stuck one penny in each of the slits. Next we put a screw in each of the lemons on the opposite side of the penny. Then we used the pliers to cut three pieces of steel wire that are about three to four inches long. If we're using alligator clip, we could tip this down. Um, next we used a screwdriver to unscrew the screws in the calculator. But we had to be careful not to break the calculator. Then we saw a battery, a place for the battery, and two wires, red and black. Next, we removed the battery. Then we um, saw the wires connected to the battery spot. Then we cut those wires as close to the battery spot as possible. Then we used the wire stripper to strip the wires, but we only stripped about five inches. Next, from step five, we use one of the pieces of steel wire from the penny and connect it to the and um, connect it to the other lemon screw. Next, we connected the other steel wire from to the screw, but not connected to the other lemon's penny. Then we connected the other steel wire to the screw, but, uh, the penny, but not connected to the other lemon screw. Then um, the penny is a positive charge and the uh, screw is a negative charge. Then we connected the wires correctly with each other. Red with positive, black with negative. Then we taped it together. Um, next, we used a blade to cut two small slits for the wires to stick out from the calculator. Then we put the back of the calculator on carefully and taped it back together. And uh, if, the, if the procedures are too hard to follow, then you could just watch our presentation. Uh, you can watch our demonstration after our presentation. Okay, stop. Our conclusion is we found that lemons can create power. For example, we found out that lemons have enough power to make a calculator work without the use of industrial batteries. Um, these are the pictures we have. This, this picture is the lemons that we used. Um, this shows that it works. That picture shows that there is no battery. And this picture shows the materials. And uh, this is the schematic of how to wire everything. Okay. Okay, and now uh, we're going to start a presentation. One moment and two. And if you haven't noticed, our um, mechanism is powered by lemons. Okay? So then you come in, you go all the way in. Pop. Pause it, pause it, pause it, pause it, pause, pause it, it. Stop, pause stop, it. stop, stop, stop. Okay, so what you'll do is you take these scissors, uh, open it up, and cut a slip around right here on both the lemons. Uh, right here. Okay. Like that. You will take these two pennies, stick one in here, about halfway. Okay, like that. And then we take this and put it in here, like that. And then we take the other screw in here. Now we put the screws in, which we already did for that one. And now we connect this clip to this penny. 
like that. And this clip to this penny. Like yeah. that. And now it should work. If you can see, and um, oh. whoa. Like, see, five, five times, times two, two equals, equals ten. ten. And it works.